You ever met somebody that was just mean in every aspect of their lives? They do things to people and they don't care how it affects them, but everything has to be right for them. They could be a dark triad personality. Dark triad? What's that? We're going to talk about it. How you doing? This is Terry Gown Wilson, aka Yo Boy Brother T, here with another one. Oh, so I like to thank you and welcome to the New Life Tree, where we like to give you little pine cones of wisdom for your motivation and mental health. If you don't know what that is, stick around, stay on the channel, you'll get it. So today we're going to talk about the dark triad personality. It sounds interesting. It sounds like some kind of uh, um, you know, something out of a movie, a comic book movie or something. The Dark, dark Triad. Superman had to beat up the Dark Triad. I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. So, <laughs> the Dark Triad. Let's go into what it is. Okay, so the Dark Triad is the psychological theory of personality first published by Delroy L. Paulus and Kevin M. Williams in 2002. It describes three notably offensive but non-pathological personality types. Machiavellianism, subclinical narcissism, and subclinical psychopathy. Wow, that was a lot. <laughs> what we're going to do, we're going to take that. You're going to see it on the screen. There's the graphic with the triangle. Now, these people that put, put, you know, that possess this certain personality will exhibit all three of these traits. This is just a theory. Let's go into what each one of those traits are. So the first one is Machiavellianism. Say that five times <laughs> real fast, right? So in the field of personality psychology, Machiavellianism is a personality trait centered on manipulative behavior, callousness, and indifference to morality. So, these people will do anything to anybody as long as they're benefiting and they don't care what the fallout is, right? Basically, that's what it is because uh, before that, and, and a lot of people, we heard of, of Machiavelli, right? The writer, and of course, Tupac, I think he called himself Machiavelli before he passed away. But especially when somebody's being manipulative all the freaking time. <laughs> now, all of us may be guilty of manipulating from time to time. But when you see a person and they live their lives like that, be very cautious with that type of person. That's all I'm saying. So the second personality trait is... Uh, narcissism and we had another episode on narcissism i'll put it somewhere either it'll be up there or maybe at the end of the show you'll see it come up as one of the videos check that video out it's a very cool video just like this one but thank you for being here right now so what's narcissism narcissism excessive interest uh in or admiration of oneself and one's physical appearance now uh, we all can be uh, have a little bit of touch, a little touch of that narcissism, <laughs> especially when we know we looking good, baby. When you clean up and you looking good, and you look in the mirror, and you're like, Ooh, hoo, hoo. it's okay to do that sometimes. <laughs> it's okay to do that sometimes. That's not unhealthy to do that from time to time, especially if it's the truth, right? Cause your boy be in the mirror. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so, I'm just kidding. But when it becomes a preoccupation and you're preoccupied with it, and that's all you can do is look in the mirror and look at how you look. And, and if you do that all day long to the point where you don't do anything else, <laughs> 
you at work doing that. You you at work in the mirror in the phone in the mirror in the phone taking selfies in the mirror phone selfie mirror phone so you know stop it. <laughs> That's narcissism for real. Now us being in this new well not new but us being in this social media age a lot of narcissism running around and i know you're thinking like the ig models and stuff like that and some of the no but the guys too right we you know there's a lot of narcissism running around like i said it's okay to know that you're you know handsome it's okay to know that you're a good looking woman especially if you get a lot of compliments and people come up to you but don't do it to the point where that's all you think about and that's the only important thing in your life i think you know what i'm saying so the third uh a trait there is a uh, psychopathy so let's look at what psychopathy is that is a common mental disorder it is characterized by personality traits that include reduced empathy or remorse, a bold and daring personality, and difficulty inhibiting behaviors. Yeah, I really do think that's common. That's common in a lot of us. And there are times where all of us are going to line up with this, right? Because there are times where you're going to... Um, have reduced empathy especially if you don't like the person <laughs> let's be honest or let's say the person did something to you previously you'll have a reduced empathy at that point You're not supposed to but naturally sometimes that's what we do as a protective mechanism to keep us from being uh, mishandled by that person again or taken advantage of or whatever or just to get back at them sometimes you just want revenge right <laughs> but the problem comes in when it uh when it overwhelms your life and and when you uh, uh can't stop yourself from being that way feeling a lack of empathy for certain people right but when you can't stop yourself from doing that and you start doing it to people that don't even deserve it we're in a whole different ball game at that point so let's take a look at the three part of the three parts of the triad sorry so let's go to the triangle there i know you love that triangle don't you <laughs> so look out for these things and remember i am not a licensed therapist so don't look at this show and start diagnosing your husband and your wife <laughs> okay don't go home and say t brother t said you have the dark triad so i gotta i gotta i, I want a divorce <laughs> so don't, please don't do that to me people this is for informational purposes and this is for you to notice especially if you are exhibiting a lot of these traits this is more for self-diagnosis than to go around and accuse people of things so those three traits once again are machiavellianism narcissism and psychopathy make sure if you're exhibiting i would say two of these traits or more or, or all three get help <laughs> you might have to get some help and stop mistreating people out there this is your man brother t i hope you enjoyed the episode of course we're gonna bring you something good later so stay tuned family thanks for coming through i gotta go peace